Yeah. So Shakiri has gone to Liverpool. Thirteen point five million, as was his relegation clause, um, right. which is infuriating because we always seem to do this. Stoke he, in this market, this day and age, I'd like to think twenty five. I don't know if he's worth twenty five, but you look at the market. Some players going for stupid amounts. What is he worth then? I think in this market, if he was under contract, there's no clauses. I think we could easily negotiate twenty five million. And it sounds daft to say that. How old is but, he? Twenty seven. Uh, twenty. Six, I think. Okay. Twenty six. Yeah. It sounds daft to say that because it's insane money, but the market's crazy. So yeah, I, th- I think twenty five easily. Um, so I think we've lost over ten million there straight away. Cheers to the CEO for that. Tony mm. Scholl. But did do you think he? You think that might be part of the negotiations of playing for Stoke? Yeah, team? yeah. Don't get me wrong. When we trying to sign Shakiri, I don't think he was like our oh, quality Stoker in for me. I wonder no illusion as a Stoke fan that that was his d- dream and desire to to play for the Potters. But you know you have to roll the dice a little bit. But still, we are a team that is forever going to be a threat of relegation because that's how it works. Teams yeah, like yeah Stoke. Totally. So you need to be smart with that sort of thing. Um, was last season the best season he's had? Yeah, easily. He's got eight goals. My voice went there. You hear it? Can you beat it? Yeah, can you beat it? Yeah. Uh, he's got eight goals, which was, I think... No, not for Shigiri. I know he's little. <laughs> <laughs> um, he's got eight goals, which is double his best tally for Stoke. If you speak to Stoke fans, some people like... He's clearly our best player. He was the best player last season. Anyone that says anything else is, is speaking shit. It's ridiculous. I am definitely one of those that people would quote as speaking shit. I don't think his season was that great. He scored eight goals. Um, he was definitely the sort of player that we'd, we'd look to. You haven't set up your comment very well then. <laughs> no, I'm not. He was the player I'm going to be talking shit. Go he was the player that we would look to to do something. But he was just far, far, far too inconsistent. Shakiri is is slow. I think there's a common misconception that he's quick on the turn. And he's a nippy winger. He is no in a million years is he a nippy winger. Right. He's too slow, and for his bulk, he's not that strong. If you give Shakiri the he's so bulky, isn't he? Yeah. It's, it's odd. It's, it is ridiculous. He doesn't look like a, I don't know what he looked like a bodybuilder, a little powerlifter <laughs> or something. It's weird. Don't answer that. But the amount of times that I'd say it in my mind when I was watching Stoke, when I was down Stoke, I was watching Shakiri play. The ball would get past to Shaq, Shakiri, big Shaq, big Shaq. The the defender would instantly be on him, and I'd say out loud to those that would bother listening around me, say, "I guarantee you'll lose the ball in a minute." Going to 50-50 with Shakiri when he's got possession, that sort of moment, he always loses the ball. Really, he's only effective when he's got plenty of space around him, and other players, quality players, are pulling and creating that sort of space. With Stoke, we never had that space because we didn't have the sort of quality. Right. And he was he was infuriating for me, weirdly. And some Stoke fans, if they watch this, will think I'm an idiot. Some will completely agree. Yeah, he scored some great goals, but he just... He, I've never seen a player drift as much in a game. I'd be so ineffective, but then do something amazing. Right. But it was infuriating when we were battling relegation. Do you... I'm probably being harsh there because he was he was playing with a lot so of what, So list, list his strengths. Strengths is it's shooting. He's got a great strike. <laughs> <laughs> the office, that's for the office. Which <laughs> <Eczema. laughs> <Eczema. laughs> Strengths. He's for eczema. Yeah, yeah. Got strengths. <laughs> Football. Yeah. Um, okay, shooting. <laughs> G- give him a bit of space and time, and he'll he'll. He's great at kind of shooting. <laughs> I don't know how to put it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Technically, he's. You've seen it. He's he's a YouTube all, player. All, isn't yeah, yeah, hundred percent. But but you, you you're never gifted space and time in Premier League football. The best, best players, the old cliche, they always look like they've got time on the ball. He never did. Really? He always seemed like someone was on him. Is that just because he sort of scurries about? I don't about know. It? I don't know. I, so his strengths is, is that strike, the striking of the ball, which sounds ridiculous. <laughs> I don't know how best to put it, but he yeah. needs space to, to enact that. Right. Weaknesses. He's put height. <laughs> <laughs> Weaknesses. With, with height and expert, I'd say he, he, he's, he's slow and he's not strong. Oh, shit, sorry. He's slow and he's not strong. I feel like I've absolutely sent him to the kind of... Uh, I've completely flagged him off there. There was a lot of good qualities with Shakiri. But he's so... Which is inconsistent. <laughs> I mean, it says a lot that he's your best player. Well, exactly. We got relegated, didn't we? Yeah, yeah. We, we, he's but just you're... so inconsistent. Right. But I do think... But sorry, well, just to get to the bottom of the inconsistent thing. I feel like I've been quite muddled with this. I've half picked him off, half slagged him off. And... I, but, but maybe that's the truth then, because I think... Uh, you've consistent. seen him score screamers yeah, 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 for... Yeah. And he's a match of the day player a little yeah, bit, isn't yeah, he? yeah, yeah. But when you say inconsistent, do you, do you mean in terms of uh, his retention of the ball or his his, how much he's involved in the game? Yeah, them two things. Thank you for putting it like that because I was getting, I was getting um, 
could totally model that. Retention of the ball is awful, and his drifting in and out of the game right. is, is poor. You right. want him to drift in the which game. Is, is which w- should al- alarm l- Liverpool fans, because this is a guy who's the main man for Switzerland. Mm-hmm. He's the main man for Stoke. So he should be involved. He should be the guy that they're looking to give yeah, the ball to yeah. all the time. And, and I'd imagine the tactics Again, look to do that. I'm look sure, to give him the ball. Yeah, I'm sure that when opposition teams played Stoke, it was always cliche with that Shaq's the best, Shaqiri's the best mm. player. Big Shaq. Mark up on him, double up on him. Mm. So I am very intrigued, and it would not surprise me. Now he's playing with better players. He's a little bit older. Come on, keep going. I wonder what you're laughing at. No, no, no. I'm just saying um, Shaqiri fans. Do you want to do it? Uh, yeah, so you're saying his hips lie. His hips do lie. Yeah. You put that little thing. I think when he's at Liverpool and they've got better players around who take the focus of the opposition, I think, I think I won't be surprised if we see a, a good season from him. So I was reading up on him, and so this article was suggesting that he's he's a bit of a bargain for them. And I think in terms of price, so you might as well just chuck 30 million and yeah, see what yeah, comes yeah, back, because it is yeah. so little. Yeah, go on, yeah. take it then. Yeah. Uh, now, 30.5, okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but that, they were saying that it, wherever he's been, he's always got about three key passes a game, which apparently is quite good. Mm. And at Stoke, he was doing around the same numbers for a team that got relegated. Yeah. Um, more assists than Richarlison... Um, more assists than someone else it's escaping now but where they were so this is the last kind of last question on Shakiri is that where will he play for, for Liverpool now the way that they're set up mm. play two they play a back four and the full backs like to get forward and yeah. then it's a, a it's two sets of three yeah so against better teams they might play two that are a bit more holding and then an attacking midfielder yeah and then on other occasions they'll have probably Fabinho who will sit or Henderson who will just yeah, sit yeah. And then they're gonna have Naby Keita, yeah. And they're gonna and Shakiri maybe playing that. That that, that Shakiri. When you've got the two holding uh, midfielders, he's the one that's gonna. He's, he's, just he's number. Order. He never really played here for Stoke, but for me, he's number ten all day long. Right. All day long. He's he's not one of them two that's gonna be left and right of the strike. Right. So he can't do that. That's, he's that's, can't do Mane. Can't do. Salah, no, because I think he's not. He's known as a winger he, initially. And it's 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 it, you've been fed a lie, Jay. He's not a winger. He's not wing, he's not quick enough and he's not strong so, enough. He needs space in that number 10 role. And I think Liverpool have got the quality to create that for him. I, I, I think despite me being a bit critical, I could easily see him having a great season. <laughs> wow. For, for Liverpool. You've gone around the houses there. Right, for right. Liverpool, purely because it's a different thing. Um, I do understand that he would have been marked out as our best player, maybe doubled upon. He wasn't playing with good players, we got relegated, etc, etc. Um and he could do it with better players. Has he got the work rate that's needed to be a Liverpool player on the clock? No. No. No, I don't think he has. But again, to his detriment, he was in a relegated team. I think he kind of thought. There might be an aspect of the Wijnaldum's about him. Mm. Wijnaldum was with Newcastle, had moments, and he was seen as their best player, but yeah. ultimately they got relegated, and Newcastle fans didn't really like him. Yeah. But then when he was playing with better players, he yeah. was able to do a bit more. I, I, feel like I think I've, he knows he can't get away with not working either. I feel like I've, I may have confused people there. 